Hi, people have asked about the little um, LED and how it fits on. So this was that switch idea that I talked about, where it holds on like that, and then when you twist it around to here, it turns on. Um, the other option is you can actually put the whole thing on like that, and it's, it's permanently able to be um, connected. Now, what I was going to do um, was actually just show you on the multimeter, um, the actual... Um, this is a multimeter here. I was actually going to show you uh, what it actually looks like um, with regards to the amount of amps it uses. So if we turn this around to the amp setting, uh, just set this up here like that, we'll be able to um, put this across the two terminals. Um, one terminal there and the other terminal underneath like that and we'll be able to give you an amp reading when the light goes. So the light's going, so that's 0 0.2, so that's 20 milliamps um, that that light is drawing at that power there. Now, if we change that back, uh, since we know what that is, and we'll get the voltage uh, across the battery, and then when the voltage across the battery is actually burning. So we'll just plug that in uh, to here, like this, and then we will put this on here. So the voltage is 8.09 volts. Usually it goes to 8.1, so it's almost fully charged at 8.2. Now, once we put the light on, we'll be able to check the voltage across there um, like this, and then we'll be able to get another reading of how much the voltage goes down. So the voltage is 7.96. So we're losing um, 1.4 of a volt uh, with regards to the light being on uh, as opposed to it being off. So there you have it. That's a little test um, with our little light. Uh, so any questions about this? I, I, to me, the ergonomics are the best part of it. It's so easy to hold, and uh, it's also quite good to, for safety. You know, if you just leave it stored like that, um, and the, any 9 volt battery becomes, in an emergency, the ability to become a torch. You can do your Morse code um, with this by having that. So if you need to do your Morse code, um, you can do a Morse code signal. And there you go. So thanks for a good.